You're watching EAC News. Thank you for joining us. China's foreign minister, Wang Yi, is set to embark on a diplomatic tour of Singapore, Malaysia, and Cambodia from August 10th through 13th with the aim of enhancing strategic communication and fostering stronger relationships with the three key Southeast Asian nations. EAC News reporter Anthony Ellis has more. Mr. Wang's visit begins in Singapore today upon the invitation of the Minister of Foreign Affairs, Vivian Brakwishanan. During his stay, he is scheduled to meet with Prime Minister Li Sing Lung and the Deputy Prime Minister Lawrence Wong. Following the engagement in Singapore, Wang is to travel to Malaysia to engage in discussions with the Foreign Minister Zamri Abd Kader on Saturday. On Sunday, his diplomatic journey will lead him to Cambodia, where he is to meet with Foreign Minister Prak Sakon. In a statement issued by the Chinese Foreign Ministry, Mr. Wang's visit is hailed as an important opportunity to promote the development of China-ASEAN relations. The ministry underscored China's intent to strengthen strategic communications with these nations and to foster a closer community with a shared future. This diplomatic tour with Mr. Wang comes as the juncture where China is actively pursuing the reinforcement of its relations within Southeast Asia. The region holds a significant strategic importance to China due to the major shipping lanes and abundant natural resources. Over the last few decades, China has made some substantial investments in Southeast Asia, signaling its aspirations to broaden its economic and political influence across the region. Anticipation surrounds the outcomes of Wang's diplomatic engagements in Singapore, Malaysia and Cambodia. This tour holds the potential to yield new agreements spanning trade, investment and security domains. Furthermore, it is poisoned to continue to be improved relations between China and the three countries. Only time will unveil the lasting impact of Wang's diplomatic venture, shedding light on its potential transformative effects. Anthony Ellis, EAC News.